hello my viewer this is the second concept related with your projectile mechanics to find velocity of a projectile at a height y is equal to h when u and alpha be given figure in velocity is u angle of projection alpha and v is the velocity at the point p x y horizontal component v cos theta vertical component v sin theta for horizontal motion vx is equal to v cos theta is equal to u cos alpha this is the first solution for vertical motion v square equal to u square plus 2as so vy square <coughs> is equal to u sin alpha whole square plus twice minus g and y vy square is equal to u square sin square alpha minus to g y and this answer is equal to v square cos square theta and from relation first v square cos square theta is equal to u square cos square pi and this is your v square sin square theta second reason here there are two unknown v and theta and two equations and hence they can be calculated v cos theta square plus v square sin square theta is equal to u square cos square alpha plus u square sin square alpha minus 2gy so after solving v square equal to u square minus 2gy so v is equal to u square 2gy this will always positive because speed cannot be negative this is the magnitude of the velocity and directions tangent 
tan theta is equal to vy by vx v sin theta divided by v cos theta and this is equal to dy by dt dx by dt and this is equal to u square sin square alpha minus 2gy square root but this component may be positive negative and divided by u cos alpha and this negative is due to if you find at this point the direction of speed velocity is along this one but the angle is your minus theta and the component vertical downward will be vy that is negative but vx is always positive therefore there is negative sign also possible and this answer shows the direction relation force relation force that's all